This is BBC News with the latest headlines for viewers in the UK and around the world. Ukraine's president said international rules protecting countries from attack are no longer working amid fears of a Russian invasion. The security architecture of our world is brittle, it is obsolete. The rules that have been agreed upon by the world dozens of years ago are not longer working. They are neither catching up with the new threats nor being effective in overcoming them. And as reports emerge of shelling in eastern Ukraine, the British Prime Minister issues a new warning about the consequences of any Russian invasion. If Ukraine is invaded and if Ukraine is overwhelmed. We will witness the destruction of a democratic state, a country that has been free for a generation with a proud history of elections. Counting the cost of Storm Eunice, 12 people die across Europe, including three in the UK, where more than 155,000 homes are still without power. The wind and the rain is hampering efforts to repair store damage and to restore power to people's homes. I'm John Watson. Coming up on Sport Today in 15 minutes' time, the Premier League title race is blown wide open. A Harry Kane-inspired Tottenham beat the league leaders, Manchester City. Hello and welcome if you're watching in the UK or around the world. The British Prime Minister has warned that any Russian invasion of Ukraine would see the destruction of a democratic state. Boris Johnson said that NATO, a group of 30 nations in a military alliance, were united at a moment of extreme danger. The Ukrainian president has said his country is determined to protect itself from Russia with or without the support of Western allies. Paul Adams has the latest from Kiev. <laughs> 